Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and to another vlog. It's Easter weekend. Today is Good Friday, by the way. And let me tell you, I woke up not wanting to do anything at all. Luckily for me, I did not have a lot of things to do. I just wrapped up my last meeting of the day, which means that I can do absolutely everything I want. So yeah, I do have a couple of things that I wanted to do today. One of them being um, my medicine cabinet in my bathroom. So I wanted to tidy it up a little bit because I just realized that I have so many things in there that I either don't use or like they've expired and they're just taking up space. So I wanted to tidy that up a little bit today. And if I do have some space, I'm thinking of moving my facial care products from my closet. So I keep it in here. I can actually show you what it looks like, but it's like so cluttered in there. So I wanted to see if I can move it there. So yeah, this is the situation right here. So I have like most of my products in here, but what happens is I keep knocking off things off of here and sometimes they just fall into the um hold on let's get out of here the sliding is not the best sometimes the products fall into the laundry basket and then i spend days days looking for my pro um, my products so i wanted to see if i can move them to the medicine cabinet so it's much much easier you know i'm just gonna step out of the shower and just use them so that's what we have got going on and I also wanted to start prepping my meat for um, whatever I'm cooking this weekend so yeah let's get it going okay so this is the situation for my medicine um, cabinet it's low-key full but like I said I just have so many things in here that I don't need like for instance I have these biotin whatever supplements they're both the same i have no idea why i bought two but i have them so i don't know i think i'm gonna keep one and then for instance this eye drop that i was using when my eye was bothering me i don't think i can use this past 30 days so this has to go things like my my gaviscon too which i use for my heartburn let's look at the expiry date see this expired since 2021 and i still have it for most of these things in here i think i'm going to keep because they're my my hair products i'm sorry if you guys can't see me this lotion i'm pretty sure it has been here for way too long so that's going out to okay oh, oh my god that almost dropped into the toilet okay that's my extra brush oh, like the brush head i have this what is this it's like a hair dye i have no idea why i bought this but i don't think i'm going to be using it it's in the shade golden brown so that's out so honestly i'm just going to be going through all of these things and just try to figure out what i need and what i don't and then I'm just going to put them all back together and see if I have space for my um, my facial care products. So yeah, let's do that. Lord, give me a sign, a sign. I feel like I'm losing my mind. Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me... Wait, you guys. So I just saw this texturizer and I believe it's like half of the bottle but do you guys think I can use this after a couple of months this has not been mixed by the way but I'm not sure let me know if you've used like texturizers or like hair straight straighteners in the past please let me know if I can actually reuse this because if I can I can save this for my next batch 
feel like I'm losing my mind Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign A sign I feel like I'm losing my mind Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign A sign Yeah! There's no mercy in this world, just hunger, thirsty persons in different versions. Each do what they that shit. So this is what the situation's looking like. I have stuff here that I hardly reach for or like new things that I have not used yet up here. And down here you would see that I have my facial care products. I use these on a daily, so these will be perfect here. And then these are the hair care products that I use every wash day as well I use these so often so you would see that I still have some space in here so this would be perfect because if I do have any new products I can still put them in here I've cleaned all of my meats. I actually had chicken as well, but I marinated that and put it away. Want to do the same with the beef. So I've already added in salt, and I'm gonna be cooking some banachin. So I wanted to try not to put in too. Ooh, that's a lot of black pepper. Oh my god! But it's gonna be white banachin, so this actually gives it flavor. The black pepper. Yeah, I, I was going to say that I'm going to try not to put in way too much seasoning because there's that tendency for it to burn when you're frying it. So I'm going to try not to put in way too much, especially the garlic, since that gives it a bitter taste when you fry it. I mean, at least when it gets burned. So yeah, I'm just going to put in all of the dry spices. In and I have the wet spices no not the wet spices the wet marinade so that's what we're gonna do that's the wet marinade right there just have my garlic and the peppers and a little bit of ginger so that's what I'm gonna put in here let's start with that and mix and then open it away so by the time we need it it's gonna be super flavorful the next day it's Saturday so today I have a lot of things a lot of things on the lineup to do I just soaked my brushes I need to clean them and that is like one of my most hated chores ever I just hate cleaning my brushes but then I gotta do it because I don't want to use dirty brushes on my face so that's that what else do I gotta do? Oh, I also wanted to meal prep because I want it to be really quick when I start cooking tomorrow. Because I feel like the frying process takes, it's like the most, it's like the main part of the cooking, if you ask me. So I might fry the chicken and beef, cut up my veggies and all that so it's nice and easy when I cook. And what else do I gotta do? I gotta wash my hair what else oh i want to make some juice as well so there's this local juice that we make in gambia it's called boy so my sister actually sent me some hold on she got me more of this i actually had some but it wasn't a lot but it's it's the baobab flower if you may have seen this at the african store you can use this for different things but i'm just gonna make some juice so I did realize that I don't drink this as often here in the US. I think I've been going more for Wanja slash Zobo. I don't know. I don't even know why. But this is so, so tasty. If you haven't tried this yet, you need to. I'm going to be making that today. 
actually this usually contains milk so I kind of see why I haven't been drinking this as much because that just means bloating for the next couple of days and it, it is not comfortable at all so I'm gonna be adding some milk I do have condensed milk as well so maybe I might put that in there and I got this um, it's just decorating gel like food gel that I'm gonna put in there to give it a little bit of color it's gonna be cute not cute it's gonna be tasty <laughs> gonna be tasty okay so i have this long long day ahead so i don't think i'm gonna be talking much today so i guess you're just going to watch and enjoy you're giving me wind and rain you're some kind of butterfly baby you get me feel lighter you whip up my appetite don't leave me here high and dry Happy Easter to everybody celebrating. It's Sunday and I am dressed to the nines to go to church. Um, I'm trying not to run late, but I wanted to check in with you guys before I head out. This is the fit and I do have a little ponytail situation going on. I did curl the ends a little bit, but they've kind of fallen. But I don't really mind because I didn't really want the curls to be too tight. So I do like how my makeup turned out too. Who is she? Like I even put on eyeshadow today. I am looking cute. So yeah, I'm just excited to go to church today. So I, I don't know. I've been contemplating on which accessories to wear. I'm thinking of wearing either green or, hold on, blue. Because my outfit essentially is all nude and like splashes of black here and there. So these are the two options, either green or blue. I think both would go since this is a neutral, the base. Let's see. Okay, I think I'll go with the green. You guys know I love the green. I think this brings out like the outfit, the beauty of the outfit even more so we'll go with the green and that's even better because i do have a matching purse that i can wear so it's gonna ooh, y'all see that it's gonna be cute so i'm just gonna put this on and head out the door because i really don't want to be late i just know the church is gonna be packed full today so yeah let's do that All right, guys. So much here, pare na. Regal na, pare. 
I'm done cooking guys and this is the outcome you can't tell me this does not look appetizing it's so colorful and it just looks so good I'm about to dig in y'all I am so hungry I haven't had breakfast so this is gonna be like breakfast and lunch in one I cannot wait so hungry right now so honestly for the rest of the day i'm not really gonna do anything i just want to have a really chill day i'm probably gonna be watching some youtube videos for the rest of the day that's exactly how i planned it so yeah but if you did enjoy this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up and until i come your way next time bye guys